OK guys, Charles is going to continue the negotiations for better copper wires, I will be taking up the negotiations with Shine Industries for the new wires. I'm really excited about this new opportunity and I don't want to lose it. I'm proud of you, Charles. Make sure that when negotiating you stay calm, and be willing to work with them. You want to stay in budget so don't be afraid to haggle down the price. Thanks for the suggestions, Lucy. I can't wait to see what I can contribute to Hoover. Finally, my two favorite subjects, magic and magnets, are coming together and I will help pave the way for the future. While Charles is busy negotiating I think it might be important if we take this time to discuss the values of Hoover while we have the chance to fix our problem. Values? Like how much we think the company is worth? Not quite. Values are the fundamentally important behaviors, activities, and outcomes of a company. For example, I think we should value customer safety and satisfaction. I agree. We can't risk the safety of our customers by selling a product that will melt your phone or potentially create a fireball. By keeping our customers' safety as one of our top priorities I can almost guarantee that they will be much more satisfied. Yeah customer satisfaction and safety are cool and all, but do you guys know what we should value even more? What? Increasing our profits. I don't agree with that. I don't either. Hoover will value our customers by ensuring their safety and satisfaction by using quality wires from the new supplier Charles will pick out. We will be honest. We'll see just how great this supplier Charles picks out is. I'm going to see what I can do about this. I want the money. Let's test the new wires Charles brought back. What the heck? It worked last time I tried. I trust Charles. I don't think he mistakenly chose another bad supplier. Shine Industries is one of the best. Look. The wire isn't copper anymore. It looks like it was painted. Who would have done this? Why would someone switch out good wires with painted trash? Houdini must have done this. It makes sense. He wanted to save money and gain bigger profits. This was unethical of him to go behind our backs and do this. We'll have to tell everyone. So it seems someone decided to change the wires without telling anyone and that is why the test failed again. So you mean my wires weren't faulty? You're saying they weren't even the wires I chose? Exactly. We believe Houdini did this. What? How dare you? I'm trying to help this company. My plan hasn't gone exactly as I thought it would. I didn't expect them to find me out like this. It appears I still have a lot more work to do. Well it's obvious that we'll have to postpone the launch still. It's the right thing to do. We can't risk what we saw at the test. Hopefully this dream of ours will work out sooner rather than later. I'm sure it will if Houdini doesn't try any more tricks like he did today.